contribuire alla formazione della prossima generazione di leader femminili nei paesi del Nord Africa e del Medio Oriente. E questo è l'obiettivo della Women in Diplomacy Winter School, la scuola diplomatica giunta alla sua seconda edizione e organizzata dalla Farnesina e dalla SIOI in collaborazione con l'ISPI. L'iniziativa di scambio giovanile multidisciplinare ha coinvolto per una settimana 20 giovani donne sotto i 35 anni, provenienti da Egitto, Iraq, Israele, Giordania, Libano, Libia e altri paesi di particolare rilievo che stanno vivendo una fase di transizione. There is an old uh, proverb saying that if you teach a woman, you teach a whole community. Women are half of the global population and by having women in a better position, we have the society in a better position. It's a great initiative from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Italy to uh, make this uh, Women in Diplomacy School and uh, build a new generation of leadership, women leadership in the region. The empowerment of women is, I think, a very important factor when it comes to uh, peaceful transitions and uh, uh, democratic transitions of, of uh, countries. And we need diplomacy more than anything, and we need women in diplomacy also, because women always try to build consensus, to keep away from conflicts. Another aspect is empowering women in diplomacy because in certain countries there are still discrimination against women. It's very important for us in the Middle East, countries going through transition, to open up to other countries and see how we can minimize the challenges of transition and maximize the opportunities. I think the Polish experience of a peaceful uh, uh, transition of power is something which can be very valid for many countries. Getting better in some countries means women's right to drive. In other countries means women's right to vote. In other countries means women's right to get elected. But transition is a never-ending process and we have to always strive to get better.